really don't know what to do. So I don't understand the reason behind his actions. Mm. I don't even know why he acts this way. Don't worry, everything will be alright. Would it? Yes, definitely. Remember in the Bible, Jeremiah 29, verses 11, be encouraged. God knows all the plans for your life better than yourself. He created you at the end of the day and you'll bring you to your expected outcome, okay? The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in the green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness. Would you rather be with a man that's not God's chosen for you? Would you rather choose a man over God? I didn't say that. Oh, I'd never do a thing like that. You know me better than that. Exactly. If he's really the Christian guy he claims to be, he'll not make you do anything that will make you dishonor God with your body. How is it this girl is making you go so soft? This is not the Dave I used to know. The Dave I used to know would have tapped that thing a long time ago. I have tried virtually everything that I know, every single skill that I have, but she's still bent on getting married. Marriage? Really? Yes, that's what she keeps saying every single time. Marriage, 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 marriage. You need to step up your game. How would you know she's what you want in that area? I thought about the same thing you did. Okay, and I said, okay, let's give it two years. Okay, two years is a great long time. I gave two years a shot. Until today, she still doesn't want me to go in there. I want to taste. <laughs> you make me laugh. <laughs> the other day, I went to her house to have a normal conversation. And all of a sudden, she just flared up like I mentioned some abominable word. What happened? I really don't understand what the problem is. What's the big deal? We're not in a committed relationship. I mean, we're not yet man and wife, for goodness sakes. What do you call two years in a relationship? Do you think I'm here to play, eh? Do you think I'm with you to just waste my time? Dave, just calm down, all right? This is different. See, the Bible says... Oh, please, stop that nonsense. The Bible, the Bible, the Bible. Are you the only Christian? I just think we should wait until we're married before we get involved in this sexual activity. We were not married. Look, babe, I love you so much. And we're gonna get married soon, okay? Trust me. You don't even trust me. It's not that, it's just the will of God comes first before anything else. The will of God, the will of God, the will of God, every single time. Look, I'm a man. I understand the will of God, but I've got needs. And even God himself knows that, please. Good things happen so as we wait, remember? So I just need you to wait. Babe, just give me this chance. Okay, just do it for the love that we share. I beg you, please. That's not fair. And I'm not gonna be pressurized into doing this. You're losing your touch, man. Dude, if you were in my shoes, what would you have done? What is it about this girl anyway? Just dump her, dump her. She's nothing. Get her, I yeah, cannot I forget know. her, man. I cannot. Look, I love her. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know it's funny, obviously, coming from this sleep spot. Look, there's something unique about this girl. There's something special. Dude, she's honest. She's so beautiful, but I want to taste. Oh, man, you know the game. See, you know you need to first test the waters before you could dive into it. Test? Dude, this girl hasn't even agreed to open her legs, let alone letting me test her soup. She won't even let me, man. I, I want to test. I really need you to come through for me right now. <laughs> I can't do this by myself. <laughs> Lord, please give me the strength to pull through this. <laughs> you said in your word that you will make a way for me where there seems to be no way. <laughs> Please give me the strength. <laughs> I can't do this by myself. I speak peace to my soul. 
really you are loved by God. And you do not need to give in to these pressures. Bella, God loves you. You deserve so much better. Well, you are beautiful. See how beautiful God made you and put in you so many wonderful things. Thank you, Lord, for your grace and mercy. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus, Jesus' name I have prayed. Amen. I don't want to lose him. It's like I love him so much, it scares me sometimes. I just love him so much, Ray. No. But if you submit your will to God, he'll bring you the best guy out there at the right time. And you don't have to be turned up or confused about the issue. I don't know what's happening. But it's, I'm literally on the verge of losing him and I honestly don't want that to happen. Take me for example. Me and Mike, before we got married, we didn't do anything. We waited until our wedding night, and that made it more special. Look, babe, remember what the Bible says. We have dominion over everything. That includes our emotions and the ability to make the right decision. Yeah, but... There are no buts. You need to submit your will to God, and He will direct all your paths. You will be able to make the right decision. You need to trust God. Come on, baby, please, I beg you. Please, just this once, please. Just shut up, all right? I've had just about enough of your nonsense. OK, please. I'm going to make you a promise, all right? Look, I'm going to take it slow, very, very gentle. You won't even feel it, and you will enjoy it. I beg you, please. You promise? I promise, baby, cross my heart. You will enjoy it, please, baby, please. Please. Look, no way. Dave, I'm not going to dishonor God just because I love you. But God will understand. Speak to him. You speak to him every day, don't you? Speak to him. You understand. Please, baby. I beg you. Just this once. Dave, you got two choices. You either wait until the right time in the sight of God, which is until we say I do in the presence of God and witnessed, or you can just walk out that door and never look back. Please, just this once. I beg you, please. Goodbye, David. Please, just this once, please. Please.